Introduce yourself. What is your name? Oh, yeah, cool. Okay, cool. all right. Well, I got give it a second. Yeah. Hi, I'm Oceana Javelin, and I'm playing Abigail Williams in the Crystal uh, I'm Jackie. I'm a senior. And yeah, this is my this is my fourth fourth or fifth production doing lights at St. Monica's. Hi, I'm JD. Um, I'm the assistant director of the Crucible, which means I'm like pretty awesome. I'm Carly Cameo. <laughs> uh, what grade are you in? Freshman, so ninth. I am on cast and my role is Tichuba. How do you feel like the show has been going so far? I think it's been pretty good. I've actually enjoyed the putting together of the show a lot. I thought that it's been really fun and I'm very happy with how the show's been going. So, yeah. Uh, is, this, is this your first time as assistant director? What's been your experience with theater in the past at St. Monica's? This is not my first time as assistant director. Last year during Clue, I was also assistant director. And for freshman year, I was in cast for the play. I was a techie for the musical. And then last year, I'm assistant director for Clue and assistant stage manager for Into the Woods. And this year, I'm assistant director for The Crucible and hopefully for Mean Girls, I'll be cast. How do you feel like the show is going so far? Um, I think the show is going really well. I'm really proud of everyone on cast and crew, especially with where we were at at Tech Week. I think that we've come a really long way. Um, so I think it's going pretty well. What's your role on cast and or crew? I am the head lightboard director. So I basically just set up all the lights for the show and then make all the cues and run the show. How do you feel like the show is going so far? I think it's going really well, actually. Uh, I think Luke's doing a great job. I think all of the cast is doing a great job. It is very, it's pretty intense. So I think that so far it has been going very well. Do you feel like theater at St. Monica is different from theater you might have done anywhere else in the past? Why or why not? When I did a couple other shows with a different production company, uh, I had a lot less lights to work with. So it was very, it was a lot harder like to set the mood and everything with the lights, but overall I feel like the social environment that I was in was honestly pretty similar. It's all like pretty great. So. Uh, how do you feel like lighting impacts the show? Do you feel like it's a, an important part of, of the show? Not to, not to pat myself on the back, but I think lighting is a very important part of the show. It really like I said before, it kind of sets the whole like mood of the show. We have one fire scene. I don't know if I can say that. Can I say that? Okay. We have one like fire scene, and I basically do the whole fire with lights, and I it would not be the same without it. And I think the whole show is kind of just the whole mood of the show is basically from the lighting, whether it's dim and it's like a grim setting or bright and a happy setting. So. How do you feel like the show is going so far? It's going good. I really like it. I'm bonding with a lot of um, cast and crew members. Do you feel like theater at St. Monica is different from any theater you might have done in the past? Why or why not? Yes and no. I still feel like I'm still bonding with theater kids, which is a good thing for me. But it's kind of, it's bigger program here, which I also like. So it's, a, it's in all good ways. Awesome. Do you feel like this has been a good experience for you as a freshman? Yeah, it has. Theater here is great. Play has been good. Can't wait to see the musical. And if this is going to be posted right before the show, come see the show, please. Do you, think, do you think you're going to continue to do theater here? Absolutely, yes. <laughs> do you feel like theater at St. Monica is different from any theater you might have done in the past? Why or why not? I think that theater at St. Monica's is different than like other theater I've done because everyone in the VPA department is so close with each other and it's like one big little friendship circle where we're all like happy and have fun together. Do you feel like theater at St. Monica is different from theater you've done anywhere in the past? Why or why not? Um, I think it's 
different in a lot of beautiful ways. I mean, obviously, we all go to school together, so um, it's like a closer kept thing um, versus just like seeing each other at rehearsals or whatever. Um, and I think it really is more of a family. Like, we genuinely care about each other in this department, and everyone who supports it is so involved. And the parents are great, and the teachers are great. Um, Mr. Holmes is great. Cast and crew are very dedicated. Could you describe the Crucible for me? Just like the plot or the story, or just the. Yeah, could you describe yeah. the show? Um, so, The Crucible is about these girls, um, or I guess the protagonist is John Proctor. It follows a man named John Proctor. Um, but the show all starts because. Um, Mr. Paris walks in on a bunch of girls dancing in the woods, trying to make spells to make people fall in love. And my character, Abigail Williams, is trying to get John Proctor to be in love with her. Um, and it's basically just about like um, the Salem Witch Trials. It's kind of like that. Um, and so we see that happen. And then um, we see my character and a bunch of other girls um, pretending to see spirits or crying witchcraft and accusing people um, that they're the, with the devil. And so that's basically it. And then they either get hung or they have to confess that they did do that. But that's a big deal because then they're like signing their name and like, if you lie, then you're going to get condemned, and it's, like, really bad. So, even though we're all lying, all the girls are lying. I'm the main antagonist. Can, you, can, you can be silly with it. JD was, okay. like, he's goofy as hell, so. Okay. Do you have any fun facial expressions to make for the documentary? Thank you. Okay, I think eight minutes is enough. <laughs> <laughs>